गुलामी को कितने ही खूबसूरत नाम से क्यों न पुकारा जाए वो हमेशा भी रहेगी एज आई लुक एट दिस ब्यूटिफुल साइट माई माइंड गोज बैक टू द पास्ट एंड इट ऑल्सो लुक्स इन टू द फ्यूचर और यह द डिस्टेंट पास्ट सराउंड अस द ग्रेट पास्ट वेन आर एंसेस्टर्स बिल्ड ग्रेट वर्क हेयर वट वी आर गोइंग टू डू हेयर इज फॉर द फ्यूचर फॉर फ्यूचर जनरेशन फॉर यू एंड योर चिल्ड्रन एंड योर चिल्ड्रन चिल्ड्रन एंड लॉन्ग आफ्टर दैट सो दैट द वॉटर्स ऑफ दिस ग्रेट रिवर ऑफ आर्स Krishna might be utilized might be might spread out over your fields and might thus bless your work but let us think also of the old 2000 years ago when this krishna nadi brought on it came great ships here from the sea and people came here from distant countries china and japan burma and the uh, highland and ceylon they came here why because this uh, here was a great city a famous university and indian thought and culture spread out from here here stood the great city of shri parvata later known as vijayapuri here the great ikshvaku kings ruled and here above all was a great university and the great acharya nagarjuna so this place here where we sit was a great center of learning and culture and the buddhist faith not only for our own country but for many countries in asia and people came here from these distant countries to learn the message of the buddha the message of peace and good will so let us remember of that great period in our history when india was a seat of learning and light giving generously of her learning and her message and light to our neighbor countries and friends now again 2000 years later we are again free and we have renewed our bonds with all our countries neighbor countries and again i hope all of us together will work for peace and for the advancement of humanity and in this work in this great work that we are now beginning in the whole of india and of which this nagarjuna uh, sagar may well be a symbol in this great work i am sure we shall have the blessings of the our great ancestors who used to work here today what is the best prayer that we can pray what is the best temple to which we can go the best temple is a temple which is made for uh, is a work which is made for the good of our brethren and sisters the best prayer is so that our people may prosper our people's poverty and difficulties may go away and so when i laid this foundation stone here of this nagarjuna sagar to me it was a sacred ceremony to me this was the foundation of the temple of humanity of india a symbol of the new temples that we are building all over india in our country there are many religions in our country there are many provinces and states there are many languages but still our country is one and whatever religion the person may have he is an indian first in our country there are there are of course the hindus and there are the muslims and there are 
the Sikhs and the Parsis and the Bauds and the Christians. And here on this site itself, 2,000 years ago, this was not only a great site of the Buddhist faith, a great university, but also of the Hindu faith. And they lived in, in friendship with each other. So, in India, we have a tradition of living in friendship, in cooperation with each other. Remember that the message of India throughout the ages, for thousands of years, has been the message of tolerance, the message of friendship, the message of peace, the message of working together for the common good. So, now that India has become free and independent, and now that we can march ahead all together, we have to remember this message. And we must be true to the genius and culture of the great race to which we belong. Sare Jahan